Cause we are so sisters. Honestly, I do not believe why I even bother. Bother? Bother putting makeup on. I guess when she looks so naturally beautiful. <laughs> mm, what's that smell? Oh yeah, it's beef. What's up? What's wrong? Enter always clueless daring. Anyway, Kiki here was about to bore us about something she won't be bothering with any longer. What don't you want to bother us with Kiki? Thank you, dearest Deering. And while I do admit I am an amazing beauty, makeup still remains on my list of priorities. Guys, on the other hand, are out. Oh, what did Leke do to you? Leke? Who's Leke? Oh, Leke! That guy that spent more time in the mirror than actually existing, he really is old news. Kicks, the only reason Leke got the boots was because he spent more time talking about himself than about you. Admit it. Yeah, that's it. It was always, <laughs> and I could be a model, or when I dated Oluchi. <laughs> but then, really, this isn't about some guy in particular. Men have just got on my nerves and I am done with them. Tell me about it. They claim they don't want bimbos have an opinion, and they don't call you again. Despite the fact that you wore your killer heels. Personal experience is the best example I get. <laughs> anyway, I'm with you girls on this one. Remember when I went for casting? Mm -hmm. Well, I met this cute, smart guy. Hmm. Rare combination, right? Mm -hmm. Well, turns out he is cute, smart, and dirty. Yee. Figuratively and literally. Yuck! Dirty drawers. And jeans and feet, and nails, uh, and breath, uh, and everything else. Guys are not worth the stress. Girls, I think we've reached a consensus. Guys are just not worth the bother. Who's with me? Mm. I am. I'm with you, girl. My friends, one, two, three, or more people. We have resolved all bitterness be dissolved. Sustain us today to live together. Cause we are so sisters. Hey, hey, we are so sisters. We have agreed and made an accord. You don't have to impress, but only try to express. Cause we are so sister Cause we are so sister Yeah Aunties, you know what? Our new neighbor is here to see you Tell him to come in Hello, lovely ladies. Hi. I, I'm very sorry to badge in on you like this. You know, but I, I do have the most lame excuse in the book. My name is Shay Johnson, and I'm your neighbor. You see, because of our series of unfortunate incidents, I do not have fuel for my generator. And I noticed you guys had yours on. Oh, we are you hoping to borrow some of us? Um, what you would like to say is, we would love to offer you some, but we really don't have much now. Oh. Okay, it's fine. It's okay. But you know, I was just hoping I could be a bother for about 30 minutes. You know, for me to charge my phones and use my laptop. No problem. Oh, thank you very much. This is such a saving grace. I was right smack in the middle of an important chapter, and if I had left it for too long, 
probably I will have lost my steam. What are you writing? Oh, a novel. Oh, that's nice. I've actually written a couple of scripts myself. But I have this passion for being on stage and interpreting the writer's magical words, you know? <laughs> yes, she is quite the actress. And you? What do you do? Oh, me? I'm a doctor, I guess. But hey, I love to read too. Doctor? Really? Yes, she's our own doctor in the house. But Darren here is more into literature, aren't you, Darren? I like reading, I must admit. And maybe someday I'll write a novel. If I get around to it. Oh, I bet you will. You see, my first novel took me years to write. And after that, I won many accolades. And the second was just about wording of the pressure. This is the third and the hardest. Well, because I've not found a muse. A muse? Well, when I write, usually, I, I write from here. And when I write, usually I write from the point of view of love because I believe that's what makes us tick. But for me, I've not found the woman who will give me the spark. You know, the inspiration to, to fill my pages up. Not yet, anyway. But who knows? I might find her any day now. Could even have met her already. Auntie Derry. Auntie Derry. What? Can you help me? Help me look at the flyer. I want to begin pasting them around. It's okay. You just have to correct this. And Sunday, are you sure about this? Because if you send it out, then you have to deliver. Thank you very much, Auntie. I am very sure. This is the business that will make me. Anyway, when I make my money, I will buy some gold from you for my girlfriend. <laughs> okay, I can't wait. Cause we are so sister. Cause we are so sister. Well, the other ladies will be home soon, and I'm sure they will, as much as I am, be grateful for the gift. <laughs> Unusual though. But not that unusual when you consider the fact that gifts should be about the people receiving and what they need. You know, I came, boomed around and used some of your fuel and I thought it was best for me to give you some when I bought mine. Okay. I'm going to get myself a cold drink. Fancy one as well? I like that. Okay. Um, soft drink? Iced tea? Beer or wine? Sometimes I like to gamble. Can you choose for me? All right. Cold drink coming up. Hello, you. Nice surprise. What, you need to charge your iPod this time around? Nah, I just came to say thank you. Oh, you're very welcome then. Oh. So, um, <laughs> how is the great Nigerian novel coming? Oh, it isn't, I'm afraid. Just because I haven't found my muse. Well, <laughs> I'm anything if not nice, so let me know how I can help. Drink a lunch sometime? Hi, Kicks. <laughs> Didn't know you were back. I would have made you a drink as well. Oh. Hello, Zainab. Thank you. I help myself. Okay. So, you were saying something about a novel and you be needing a strong female lead? Strong and knows what she wants. Someone who can hold her own in a boardroom and makes a killer drink. So, what's going on on TV? Mm. Have some there. Oh, thank you. Welcome, Auntie. Oh, thank you. Auntie, please, I, I need your help. What is it, Sunday? I need to ask for an emergency leave this evening. But it's not your day off. Have you asked Zena for permission? <laughs> no. And that is why I need your help. You see, when I put out the flyer, I got some responses. 
I have more girls than the boys. And uh, there is this girl client of mine that needs to go out tonight and I don't have a guy for her. So I have to go and behave like someone else. Okay, I'll tell Zainab, but she won't be pleased. I don't, I don't know what's wrong with me. I wonder if I'm getting old. I mean, a casting ends, I go for a couple of drinks, and I lay on my bed till 12. You? Old? You will give your fellow 18-year-old castmates a run for their money. <laughs> yeah, Ginika, you are no match for the girls your age. Anyways, I have a quick call to make, so please excuse me. <laughs> your novel, um, found your muse yet? I think she's close by. That's nice to know. Um, so what's she like? <sighs> she likes the art and she's ageless too. Mona Lisa. Yes. And she's darn right funny too. Oh, now slow down, Shay. If I didn't know any better, I'll think you're trying to tell me something. Oh, I am not trying to. Hey girls! Sunday needs the evening off. Hello, Shay. Hey. Nice to see you again. <laughs> you too. Groceries. And some personal stuff. I better not look then. Thanks. Busy body. Thank you so much. You're welcome. Mm. I have to jet soon. I've been here for a while. You have? For me then. Actually, I hung around because of you. <laughs> You're just saying that probably rehearsing a chapter in your book or something? I do have my chapter. And thankfully my muse. I'm so happy for you. That must really feel good. So what's next? Tina. Oh, uh, you shouldn't be in the kitchen. Do you want to find out where all our secrets are? True that. I've got to go now. All right, let's go, let's go. <laughs> hey, Wakajube. Just when that girl was about to ask me out to dinner, she comes and puts her big mouth in my kiss. Take care, girls. And thanks for being wonderful host. What's this? Is? Host, and thank you for the thrill. You're welcome. Anytime. All right, take care. Okay, bye. Thanks. All right, take care of you. Did I hear you say sure? Yeah. I don't know what kind of conversation you guys had with him yesterday, but he brought us some fuel. He brought us fuel? Mm, well, he used some of ours yesterday. It's Ginika and Daring's fault. Shut up, Kiki. Just because you like him. I don't like him. I'm off men, remember? True. We all said we were. Besides, we shouldn't all fight over him. Who's all? I barely noticed him. So, it's settled then. No one likes him and he's just a neighbor? Mm -hmm. Hope you girls won't hate me. But he said I was his muse after all. Stupid. Not all you like, but I inspire him. Poor girls. They don't know he needs a strong female as his muse. Keep nodding, girls. I am nodding straight into a novel. Cause we are so sister. Cause we are so sister. Hey. <laughs> what a lovely dress. Oh, this old thing. I just put something on, really. I hope I'm not a bother. I just wanted a, a break from writing. Not bother at all. I was just coming in when your call came through. I prepared us something to eat. Oh, you shouldn't have. <laughs> I'm sorry to put you through all this. That. Don't worry. Let's go in. But remember, food poisoning. Well, I don't mind if it is with you. <laughs> Hey, how you doing? Nice Chick. perfume. 
Is it mine? You guys should not finish the cereal in this house. Though. I bought the last box and I still have not been reimbursed. Guinea can me. Ah, ah, forget all that water. That's a query now. Your perfume fine, no? As a matter of fact, you yourself are looking smashing. Mm -hmm. I thought we were off, guys. Who said anything about a guy here? So, where are you going with my perfume on and so much makeup on your face? Uh, uh, I'm an actress now. You're asking me where I'm going. Yes. Where else? So you're in a movie. Why didn't you tell us then? I wish. No, I'm going for a casting call. One stupid new director is in town and needs smashing ladies for a movie. <laughs> my friend just called me. They needed smashing girls and they called you. Why? To fix their makeup. <laughs> Very funny. Anyway, I'm off. I still insist that's my perfume she's wearing. And the question is, how did she get into my room? We have resolved, all bitterness be dissolved. Sustain us today to live together. Cause we are so sister. Hey, hey, we are so sister. We have agreed. Honestly, some actresses are just blondes in disguise. Can you imagine they ask a popular actress to speak like she just came back from Spain? I started speaking with an American accent. Hey yo, what the... It was just awful. Huh? But you should have seen the display that I put up. Abby, you don't trust me. Hey, hey, hey. Hello, hey. Guinea Ka. Uh, heard your voice. Hey you, how now? How was your day? Quack. Crazy, do you? Mm -hmm. My dear Derry, good job, Derry. Actually, I helped deliver a baby today. Oh my god! So I'm happy. A baby? Thanks. Yes. How cute. Was the baby cute? <laughs> what happened? Was the baby cute? Derry, the baby was a baby. And at that stage, what they are is wrinkled and sleepy. Kiki, I pray God gives you mother instincts before it is too late. <laughs> Waka oh. pass, how was your day? Oh, it was good, it was good. I got a role in a TV sitcom. Really? Yeah. That's great news. I'm really happy for you. Thank you. Thank you. Aren't you excited? I am, I am. Although it's a small non-speaking part, you know. Nothing to pop champagne for. <laughs> I still dare excited, Sha. Enough about me. How was your day, Deering? Did you do anything interesting? Interesting? No, nothing really. Hey, yeah, Kbeleo. You must have been so bored all day. No customers. No, no guest was here. <laughs> Nothing really happened. Well, I still think you need to get out more. Yeah. Um, speaking of which, where is Madame Zainab? Mm, she's not back. That's funny, because I spoke to her about 30 minutes ago and she told me she was leaving work early. Because we are I really want to lie down. I beg, Auntie Darien. Please, I need some loan. A loan? What happened to your agency? Why aren't you making money from it? Auntie, leave that matter. I have closed the business. There is no profit in women matter. All the money they pay me, I end up spending it on them again. I told you. Don't miss business and pleasure. Auntie, I am not doing it again. I have thrown away my SIM card. That is why I need small money, so that I can buy another SIM card. Hey, sonny, sonny, as Kiki would say, you they find market, market come, you they run. I'll give you something later. I cannot believe this. What's the cause of the drama right now? Remember our neighbor, the foil naked and novelist? Well, he isn't who he says he is. Speak English, Kiki. What do you mean? I went over there to say hello. And guess who opens the door? Some guy. So, I asked after him. And guess what they tell me? I hate guessing, Kiki. Apparently, he is some errand boy at a real estate firm. And he was only there to watch the house for the new buyers for a while. What? No novel? Novel? I'm surprised he could even speak English. 
And instead of a cute, charming neighbor, what we have is a man, his wife, and some kids. Oh, no. And I kissed him. You did what? I kissed him. Why would you do such a silly thing? But he said I was his muse. What? He said I was his muse. Oh, shut up, both of you. It doesn't even matter because he's not a writer. And even if he was, then I was his muse. He said no, I was, he said his I was muse. his muse. I'm very sure was his muse. I'm telling you, you but girls just shut up. First, he isn't a writer. So it doesn't matter that he needed a strong female lead. Apart from that, I thought we were off, guys. You too? <laughs> oh, I should have guessed his accent was phony. And his shoes were scuffed. <laughs> Plus, he didn't even know where he kept the wines in his house. Ah. Thank God all I did was kiss that guy. Me too. Me three. Oh, come on. When last did you know me to just kiss any guy? <laughs> if it wasn't going to be so humiliating, I'll get him fired. I think I have a better idea. Mm -hmm. But we need Sunday. Look, I'm going to tell you the same thing I told you and your friends the last 40 something times you called me. I said, my name is not Kenny and I'm not running a dating agency. Ah! Oh. Hello, look, I am not Kenny. Me and my friends, one, two, three, or more people. We have resolved, all bitterness be dissolved. Sustain us today to live together. Cause we are so sister. Hey, hey, we are so sister. We have agreed and made an accord. You don't have to impress, but only try to express. Cause we are so sister. Not forget to be kind when I start to wonder, then I might start to ponder at all the great soul sisters. But if I have to pay my 